The hurricane season officially begins today, and Prime Minister Andrew Holness is urging persons living in flood-prone areas to begin planning their evacuation routes. Bring your family together and say, all right, if this were to happen, which is the best route we should take? And where is the best place for shelter? So you want to know where would be the approved shelters of the government, but sometimes you may want to also say, all right, I have my uncle that lives up in the hill. And so I, I might have to get to him. And so you might want to call him up and say, you have that room ready for me? Speaking at a meeting of the National Disaster Risk Management Council today, residents are also reminded to secure critical documents and get emergency supplies, including first aid kits, flashlights, and medication. Property insurance is also advisable. It is absolutely important that you put aside even two or three days of food supplies. Make sure you have water, some amount of canned food, some amount of dried foods that uh, can last without refrigeration. Over the years, Jamaica has been strengthening its capacity to withstand and recover quickly from hurricanes and other natural disasters. In 2021, Jamaica became the first Caribbean country to get a catastrophe bond. If there are losses due to a hurricane, Jamaica can get up to 185 million U.S. dollars until the end of December 2023.